Well, the two suspects injured in a shootout with police after allegedly robbing a family dollar store on the city's northwest side will make their first court appearance today. Sunrise reporter Carrie Klein joins us live from the Marion County Courthouse with more on the men police say are responsible for the crime. Carrie? Yeah, good morning, Julia. The two men were injured on Sunday night when they started shooting at police. They were taken to the hospital for treatment, released, and then taken to jail. Now, 24 year old Tyel Hall, he's from Gary, and then a 19 year old Stephen Hall from Indianapolis are both accused in this store robbery and then police shootout. According to police, just before closing on Sunday night, someone called 911 to let police know that store was being robbed. They could actually see the two men through the front window wearing masks and pointing guns at the employees inside. The robbers demanded money. Now, when police arrived at that scene, they surrounded the store and then actually waited for the robbers to come out instead of going inside and potentially sparking a hostage situation. The two men did eventually come out, refused to surrender, pointed their guns at officers, and that is what led to the exchange and gunfire. A lot of crazy things going on. People trying to rob it. And like I said, I was just riding past. I stopped here a lot in the middle of the night or whatever with my two children. Now, one of those bullets in the shootout did graze one of the police officers. He was treated on the scene and is just fine now. Now, the Family Dollar Store has hired a security guard to work inside for the time being in the wake of this, just to provide some peace of mind for customers. As for the two halls, well, they are scheduled for that court appearance later on this afternoon. Reporting live from downtown, Carrie Klein, Channel 13 Eyewitness News.